we've just added some really cool new features to the Find Content module. And I'm going to show them to you in a moment, but before I do, I'd like to explain why we find content in the first place. And we do it for two reasons. The first is that we're looking for content which we can really quickly republish with very little effort on our websites. And the second is that we're looking for content which will serve as market research for us to write our own content. Now in that case, we're looking for content which uh, covers the hot topics which people are searching for and people are enjoying reading. Now the first thing you'll notice about the new feature set is that everything happens faster. When you, do a, uh, when you do a search for content and when you want to analyze that content, that whole process happens much faster. Now the first feature I want to show you is a combined list of content results. Uh, and to illustrate that, I will select a few content sources and then I will click Find Content. And you'll notice that, every, uh, that the, the list of results shows in one combined list. Whereas previously you would have to click through uh, a few of the content sources to get that list. So it's just quicker, it reduces the number of clicks. However, we can still discern where the article came from by looking at the icon which is next to it. You'll see that this one here uh, matches up with this one here, so we can tell that that article has come from eZine articles. Likewise, uh, this article here has a W, that one comes from Wikipedia. Now the next uh, feature that I want to show you is the Fetch More feature. Now there was a Fetch More feature previously, however, this one now fetches more content results for all of the content sources that we have selected here. Whereas previously the fetch more button would be next to the content source so you would have to click it for each one. So that just speeds things up. Now the next feature is going to be my favorite one and it's the ability to analyze all of these content sources, uh, sorry these content results in one hit or to specify spe uh, specific ones and analyze those ones in one hit. So to do that I would select my chosen articles and then I would click Analyze Selected and then it would uh, show up the analytical results over here for those specific ones. But uh, even better is the ability to analyze them all at once and I'm going to do that now so that I can show you another feature which depends upon this feature which is also really cool. So uh, I'll be back in a moment. Okay, now that we've analyzed all of those articles I can show you the next really cool feature that we've just added. Now this one's the ability to sort and filter through the entire list of content which we've just gathered based on its analytical data. Now the benefit of this is it means that you're going to be able to sort uh, really quickly within only a couple of clicks right through to the articles and content which is going to be the most beneficial for you uh, for use on your website. And to illustrate that all I have to do is click on uh, is click on the respective title I want to sort by. In this case age or backlinks or index count or page rank. It's just that simple. It's going to save you heaps of time and heaps of effort. Okay, now the final uh, feature that we've just added is the ability to open up and view the content in a new window. And to illustrate that, I do the same thing as that I did previously, is click on the article I want to read, and it opens up in a new window and a much bigger window. Now what this does is it just gives you more reading space, uh, greater reading, reading pleasure, less scrolling, it just makes that whole, uh, the whole process of uh, scrolling through and reading all of the articles a lot more pleasant. So these are the new, the new features that we've added to the fine content module. I hope you have a lot of fun with them, enjoy them. They're going to save you a lot of time and effort. Now, if you want to see more videos or tutorials, all you've got to do is look at the, the web address on your screen now, and um, there's more of these videos there. So enjoy.